Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Welcome to another episode in my life. So, I am right now, I have actually just done for the day with my uh, with job and I'm just getting behind the tanker truck. How convenient. Now, I'm not, I haven't been driving the tanker truck today because if I would have done that, you would actually have been seeing, right now you would have been watching some trucking videos of me driving a truck. And that is something I have noticed that if I'm driving a truck, yeah, I can, if I'm driving a tanker truck, Yes, I can vlog about it. If I'm if I would be driving long distance deliveries, yes, I would be able to vlog about it and while I'm driving a truck. But when I'm driving a garbage truck, I simply can't. And there's many reasons why why I cannot do that. And there is also a couple of reasons that I should be able to do it, but I have decided to go with the no side that I completely can't. I cannot do it because there's so many no's. <laughs> there are so many things that giving me a reason that I cannot and will not be able to vlog. When, I, when I'm driving garbage trucks. Especially in the position I am right now, where I am, I am a substitute or whatever you, whatever it's called. You know, I'm one of those guys that is, they call me if they need me and telling me that I should come in and work uh, you know I, I don't have a, a full-time job at this garbage truck company if I had that it would be a lot easier for me to vlog while I'm when I'm working but I don't have a full-time job there yet at least so another reason why I cannot simply do it And the tanker truck company is not giving me a full-time job either yet, uh, which means I cannot vlog there if they not call me and say, "Hey, you want to work for this weekend or today or whatever." They haven't called me yet uh, for another time when I when they want me to come in and work. Uh, but they will most likely next month. Uh, this month's month, it seems like they're gonna manage to fix it all by themselves. Next month, on the other hand, they haven't really decided how they want to do yet. But I have been call uh, I have been talking to one of the managers uh, that I am obviously interested in coming in and do some work you know drive a little bit uh, but that is something they have to fix later on obviously <laughs> here's the problem with my vlogs uh, I don't really plan what I want to talk about. I do plan where I want to go. Uh, but that is also starting to becoming a problem because I've basically been everywhere I can right now with my economy. You know, I can't, I can't just drive to the next town and be like, yeah, I, I have money to pay the, for the fuel. I can't really do that. If I had the money for it, if I had the funding for it, I would do it. But that is also a 
have started to become a problem for me and what I want to do with the vlogs, a vlogging on this channel. You know, I, I want to go a couple of places and then use your freaking turn signal, lady. Use it. It's there to be used. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, so, last week you saw a video, which is actually today for me, but last week for you, you saw a video about Microsoft scam call. Uh, so I actually had a call last week, a scammer, uh, telling me that they are from Microsoft Support Center or they are a partner to Microsoft and they wanted to have access to my computer and then when I uh, confronted them they started to defend themselves that they have never asked for any type of access to my computer, they just want to show me where the files are so I can myself fix the issue there is with my computer. Now they saw, uh, also did, I don't know if I did mention it, but uh, I don't really remember. But anyhow, uh, they said something about, uh, oh yeah, I'm supposed to go this way. Um, they actually started to talk something about some network interface security thingy uh, that they were about to shut it down for me. Well, go ahead, shut it down. If you can really do that, if you know which PC is my P uh, computer, then yeah, shut it down if you're actually able to do it. If you know which one is mine, go ahead. Uh, and he said he would do it, do this as well. But I haven't uh, experiencing any type of issue with my PC since then. Uh, there's there haven't been any problems with my internet connection or whatnot. Everything has been working fine. But for some reason, they threaten me that they are supposed to shut down my internet connection. Ha! <laughs> ha! Fucking scammers. Think they can scam me. Sorry for my bad well, language there, but you know, these kinds of scam or any type of scam, like the typical Microsoft scam, support scam, really just go fuck them all. If you ever meet somebody or you happen to know somebody who is working as a scammer, professional scammer. Um, and doing this kind of things, punch them in the face, please. Or just punch them in the face from me. And, to and tell them that TJ from uh, of Sweden is sending his regard. Please do it. Because this kind of scams, people are actually believing them. There are some people actually believing that there is a problem with their computer. Yeah, I, I should give you access to my p computer so you can hack into it and take over it and then demand a lot of money from me and whatnot. All of that is just bull-breaking shit. And I really badly want to punch any of those people in the face because of for example my parents they wouldn't know what to do yes 
Now, my parents are smart enough to actually understand that if somebody is calling them and starts speaking English to them, uh, they gonna contact me first and tell me about it before they make any type of decisions. But in a, in a certain uh, situation, they might be tricked and actually go ahead with whatever they are demanding. And that is an issue, because people like my parents, that is a lot older, maybe not so familiar with computers and technology like that, you know, they can easily be robbed, basically, or scammed for, from people like this, from uh, like that. I mean, and uh, yeah, it's so sad actually that older people easily get scammed by these kind of people. Whatever the, the scammer is talking about, they will somehow win over the elders. But the younger ones that is getting scammed and Oh, I didn't know better. Well, la -dee da stupid. You should know better. But then again, people doesn't... You know, if, if it was really hard to scam people, especially in my generation and our generation, uh, scam people like us or it basically impossible to do These type of scammers wouldn't exist Now people need to know how For example Microsoft is working for example Microsoft doesn't uh, call people Microsoft uh, Microsoft will not contact you if not you did contact them beforehand and they will actually use an open number so you can actually see that they are calling you plus here in Sweden they actually do have a support center that is speaking Swedish so for a people a person living here in Sweden if the person is speaking English, English to you, and especially sounds like an Indian uh, or a people, uh, a person from India, a Hindu, uh, speaking bad English to you, then most likely that is a scam. I don't know. And we're back here again. Anyhow, this might be one of my shortest vlogs ever. No, it will not be the shortest one, but it will be one of the shorters. Not the shortest. Short. Shortest. It will be a shorter one. <sighs> yeah, I'm on my way to the gym, so I'm actually preparing with some PBO and some. Uh, BCAA um, and I'm ready to pump some iron actually that would be also fun to record but that is also a problem because it's a public gym or not maybe public in that manner you actually have to pay a membership at that gym uh, but it's public in the matter that anybody can join as long as they can pay for it. Um, I actually think they are not allowing me vlogging on the gym. Now I haven't been a I haven't asked the manager about it, but if the channel is growing actually a lot more. I will definitely ask the manager if I'm allowed to record some vlogs on the gym 
and maybe if I so need to I might even promote the gym I will not earn anything by them I will not get uh, you know free membership or anything and that is a speeder he is um, that Volvo right there um, yeah stupid move sorry I wasn't a, I'm not a cop because if I would be a cop I would pull you over smack you in the face Apparently smacking people in the face is working for everything. Fix all the problems. I don't know. And now, if you did like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you disliked it, give me a thumbs down. You know the drill. Leave a comment down below if you have anything you want to tell me, ask me or whatever. And also remember to check out the links in the description down below. And where you can find all the social media links where you can find me online. Even my gaming community. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatnot, everywhere. So, till next time. See you in my next video. Bye.